Hi, Art Beaters! Um, this is Becky talking behind the camera, and I have Cynthia in front of me, and we're going to um, surprise her with some <laughs> beads so she can make a design on the fly. But first, let's just take a look outside because oh. spring has finally arrived, and yes. it's sunny. And also note Cynthia's beautiful design yeah. pieces and really pretty decorations so in her office. We're in Cynthia's office right yes, now. Yes, in our beads. Yes. Yes, at Art Beads. So, hi, everyone. Hello. Elaine says hi, and Sandy's waving to you. <laughs> Good morning. <laughs> so if you're just joining us, um, this is Becky, and I've picked some beads and components to challenge Cynthia to make something on the fly. So yeah, are you ready to see I'm super excited. what I've picked out? Yes. Okay, I'm going Let's to reveal do it. do that. Okay. Whoa. Ooh. <laughs> so these are the beads I picked out for Cynthia. I made sure to pick cool. out her favorite Far Far Away yes. seed bead blend. So those are the beads we've got for you to work with. My gosh, Hi, Kimberly. you have some beautiful so beads here, mm -hmm. uh, gemstones. Yes, some okay. Dakota Stones gemstones. I've got some garden beads, enameled leaves. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I'm excited to work yes. with those. And of course, some Swarovski pearls and crystals and some pretty colors to match. Yes. And some lovely check glass. And I even brought you some copper crimps. Oh, thanks. Some beetle on crimps, just in case. And if you need thanks. head pins and jump rings, I brought some of those, Yay, too. you're ready. Yeah. <laughs> We did one of these okay. videos over on Instagram mm -hmm. uh, live too, so I kind of learned from that one. <laughs> that maybe you might need <laughs> some copper true. findings. <laughs> That's true. Yes, Kimberly, we're challenging Cynthia to make a design on the fly with beads she has not seen yet. So I just picked some out for her and surprised her with them. Yeah. So, so she's going to get started. I know. Very excited. <laughs> Love those colors. Beautiful day outside. Mm -hmm. um, so I think. I mean, I like this color. Let's, ooh, yes. <gasps> oh, I was hoping you'd lean toward the green. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, love this one. Look at that. Yeah, it's so beautiful. It's, it's from got all a... these gorgeous colors. Yes, I got it. Okay, so I need uh, one of these first. And if you guys want the codes on anything, just let me know because I have the codes for these. Yeah, and if you have any questions, please ask. Yes, too. ask us. Kimberly says you got this. Can't wait to see what you come up with. <laughs> oh, thanks. Loving your necklace this. today. So this. beautiful. So you guys, I hope you saw that uh, Arby's Cafe video. Yes. With those brick stitch. Brick stitch and peyote stitch cuties. We've been so crazy cute. about those. And, okay, uh, Lonnie, you can come back later and it'll be on our Facebook page. Bye. All right. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I like those. We've got here some of my favorite gorgeous Swarovski colors. Pearls. Yeah, I've got some Scarabius green in there. And then I've got some Dakota Stones gemstones. Okay, got some. Love these. Okay, I need to bring some of these. Yes. So, so this is how I do. I not really sure exactly what I'm gonna use yet, mm -hmm. um, but I just doing this. Hey, does everyone? Um, can you hear me? Oh yeah, okay. can you hear us? Fine. We have I, a microphone, and yes. we totally forgot, but we'd have to get a, the attachment for it too. Oh right. <laughs> uh, yeah, those are pretty cool too. Let's try that. Hi Nat. Hi Yvette. Oh, Elaine says she can hear us. Oh good. Yay. Thank you. <laughs> Okay, so I want to start, um, I like to start in the middle usually, especially when I have a pendant. So I like to put it in the middle and then then um, I will see what I add. So because it's, uh, I hope you can see, oh, sorry, my hair is flying too. <laughs> that always happens, especially if you have animals. Yeah. So um, you see this pendant here, so I don't want to put a big bead and I want to show you why, because I feel like the bead's going to hit mm. on, oh, on Sheree, the pendant Oh, loves here. your bracelet. Oh, thank you. Gorgeous. Is that brick stitch? It is. Beautiful. It's a brick stitch. Beautiful. Gorgeous. Pattern. 
Um, so I don't want to put a big one first. I'm going to start with a small um, Swarovski. Oh, good idea. Pearl here. And then that fits much better. Mm -hmm. And then, um, let's see, you know what? Sometimes I like to put several of them Ooh. at the beginning. Let me do it like that. And then I think I'm going to do a bead cap Love with the bead caps. this. And these days, it's funny, I've been, um, I've been doing more things. So it's even I, I do this way. Pretty. Or, and this is what I do also, then I start the other way and I do something different. Oh, so you can kind of test? Exactly. What do you guys do when you're just starting out a design? Do you test out or do you like string all one side? What's your process? <laughs> Uh, there, so I want to try the bead cap. I have this idea in my mind. I like to put several uh, beads in a bead cap. Oh, yeah. Like that. That's the sequence. Ooh. And then. Ooh, Melanie uses pearl. her bead board and lays it out. That's a good idea, Melanie. That's true. We okay. are using the Art Beads Designer Jewelry Wire. Yes. It's really great wire. So 49 strand, 0 0.019 inch, mm -hmm. really great stuff. Yes, the 19 oh. inches is really good. It goes with everything. Mm -hmm. um, here, I feel like this is too dark. Um, you don't really see the crystal. It's missing something. It's missing spacers. <laughs> Cynthia <laughs> loves her spacers. <laughs> That's why I always make sure to put those in there. Thank you. <laughs> so let's try No, it's jewelry spacers. wire, Andrea. Mm -hmm. You could definitely try using something like um, Griffin silk bead cord for some color. Like if you were knotting between your beads, that would right. be really pretty. Yeah, that would be pretty with the, the Swarovski. Okay, that oh, I prefer. Oh, pretty. Yeah, that's really nice. I'm loving this green and purple um, combo so mm -hmm. much. And look at this purple here. I love it because it goes with this really light, light purple yeah. here. That's the so Swarovski like that. Crystal Lilac Shadow. Yes. So Oops. pretty. I almost put a spacer in my hair. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> and then let's do that on the other side. So the same a spacer. Jamie so lays hers good. out first because she changes her mind a lot. Sherry yes. does that too. Yes. And um, yeah, I change my mind a lot too. And sometimes I'm like, oh, that's good for me. I just stay this way. Mm -hmm. So that's a good start. Now we have those very pretty. Megan said I should give you a challenge with no spacers. Oh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> that would be cruel. <laughs> Well, if you give me seed beads, I can there use you seed go. beads as spaces. <gasps> Loving Look those oval beads. beads. Those, those are, are cute. Okay, I feel like I need something here. So, let's see. Do I add... What do you have here? You have this pretty... Yeah, that's a nice purple there. Yeah, that's a nice purple too. I like that. Let's try that. Oops. Woo! Bead party. Yeah. <laughs> That's why those trays are really great oh, because yeah, everything's falling in there. We have like so many of these stacked around the office and we can just put all kinds of different, you know, projects we're working on, things we need. Yeah. They're great. We use them all the time. Dad. Okay. Oh, I'm still not happy about that. Yeah, Melanie, Cynthia is using Pen-1468. That's that one, really pretty. Okay, I add a crystal because I wasn't sure. Ooh. What do you guys yeah. like? Do you like over here on the right or over here oh, with just the crystal? Let me show it. <laughs> Let me try that. Like that. Ooh, with the that pearl. looks good too. What are you guys thinking? Ooh, ah. that's very nice. I prefer mm -hmm. that. <laughs> Cynthia's made her mind up. I did. 
Yeah, this is a beautiful purple. Yeah, it's a really nice one. And I, that was like the last bead I pulled. Too. Oh, really? It almost didn't make it. <laughs> <laughs> That's really cool. Okay. Beautiful. I like that. So now... Gorgeous. Um, thanks. I want to go back to my copper. Mm -hmm. But let's see. It's even I put that right there right now. Or, yeah, let's do that. Since I have a, a bead cap here, I should put a bead oh, cap nice. here too. So, Balance it out. Yes. Danielle says, oh, that's really pretty. Oh, thank you. <laughs> it's funny, when I do something that is different on, on one side and another, really bother my husband. Oh, like, really? There is no symmetry. <laughs> hey, some people like, like those asymmetrical designs. Yeah. That too look cute. Mm -hmm. Like that. Let's do that. On and the it's other really side. like I don't know because it's so sunny and green out today. It's really it's really reminding me of spring. <laughs> yes. <clears throat> what colors do you guys like for spring? I really like these greens and purples or like a nice mint color. Those are always good for spring. Yeah. And another bit cap. It's kind of funny this this these colors that I pulled before I even saw you today kind of matches your shirt here. That's <laughs> true. Cool. Look at that. Okay. That Coral. Is... Yes, that's such a great color. Mint and lavender. Ooh, yes. Do, oh yeah. I guess I I'm like you. I kind of like those colors <laughs> for spring too. Uh, I think I'm gonna go back to the purple. And let's see that. Ooh. And up. Oh. Did I miss? Yes. You're getting I a thumbs up bead. from people. Cool. They like it. <laughs> cool. It's looking pretty. I love doing this because it's like <clears throat> you really um you cannot choose your when you don't choose your beads, then you really have to um, think differently. It's right. Like, okay, those yeah. were maybe not the colors I would have chosen together. How can I make it work the mm -hmm. way how I like, right? Yes. A little challenge. <clears throat> Kimberly likes aquamarine for spring. Ooh, yes. Did I have a process for picking this palette? How did I choose the beads? Yeah, how well, did you do that? Well, I know that Cynthia really loves this seed bead blend, our Far Far Away blend. <coughs> and this, okay. so I kind of in, was inspired by the colors in this blend. So I kind of picked the um, purples and greens out of there. Um, and then I wanted to use a metal that Cynthia doesn't typically use. <laughs> <laughs> so I put yeah. some copper in there. And, you know, this blend kind of has those more warm gleams to it. So, yeah, that was really fun to pick those pretty colors. So, yeah, the, our uh, designer blends are so inspiring that way because they have all those nice colors already mixed in. So it's really fun to kind of just go off of those for your color palettes. That's a great idea. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah, that's true. And, and I wanted to put some Swarovski in there because it's on sale today. <laughs> right. <laughs> and this is a beautiful color. What color is that? The Swarovski one? Do you remember? The Swarovski, I picked some emerald faceted rounds and then scarabius green pearls, which are really pretty. They've got greens and purples all in there. And then I did the iridescent purple pearls as well. And they're they're really similar to the scarabius green, but they're more purple based. But they again they have that kind of cool iridescent yeah. sheen. <clears throat> and then these bicones here that you've got are the crystal lilac shadow bicones. And these just have a really nice sparkle to them. Gorgeous. Coming along really nicely. What size wire? <laughs> Cynthia is using the Art Beads Designer Jewelry Wire, 49 strand, 0 0.019 inch diameter. And that's the one I use uh, pretty much for everything. Yes, it's it will be your go-to wire because, yeah, you can use it for everything. Okay, <clears throat> I'm getting close to the end here, I think. 
But first, I need to check that I have exactly the same amount of uh, beads. <laughs> Track your pattern. Yes. <laughs> so what I do is I bring, sorry, <coughs> I bring the two strands like that together, and then I checked, and seems good. Yeah, it looks yeah. like you got everything matched up. Oh, so pretty. <coughs> and then what I like to do is if I had a mirror. She didn't bring a mirror. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Next time. <coughs> I like to see how far it goes. Is that pretty? Ooh, I like that. Just That's there. a good length. Yeah, because then it hits just above your shirt. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that, that's the. Oh, I don't know why. <laughs> sorry. <coughs> I need to drink something. Gorgeous. Kimberly says those two pearls and brown velvet <coughs> are her fave Swarovski pearls. I almost put brown velvet pearls in there, but I maybe next time. Right. <laughs> Yes, you can get all of these beads on our website. Um, I have all the codes here. I can uh, add links after we're done here. Um, yeah, so you need to think about the length of your necklace if mm -hmm. it's like it's spring, so I won't have those sweaters or the t-shirt, you know, pretty high. So pretty much my t-shirts are this way. And uh, like Becky say, it looks really good here on my skin. So I'm gonna yeah, Stop here, hits your right neckline, me. right? Right. But I don't like just topping like that. So um, I think I'm going to just use the bead cap. Because if I stop it this way, I feel like it's a non-finish. Something mm, is missing. You want a little bit more metal in there. Yes, to exactly. To kind of go with the clasp. Exactly. Oh, and lucky you bought the right amount of beads. The <laughs> bead cap. <laughs> Yeah, I think there's um, a few more if you need more. Okay. I think it should be fine. There's two more. <laughs> so because I don't want it too long now, I'm just um, just adding one bead on those bead caps. Nice. That should be fine like that. And the bead cap that Cynthia is using is CA5515. So you see how it finished everything? Because if you look at here and you look at the bottom, so Balance. you have... Yes, it's balanced then if I didn't have it, it feels really unfinished mm. to me. All right, I can so, see what you mean. You see? Cool. Okay. That's really pretty. <laughs> yes. <laughs> okay, that's Hi, Trish. Cool. Your crimp. Uh, oh, I should have opened that for you beforehand. <laughs> that's okay, I have long I love nails. the cute little storage vials I they come know. in though. It's so cute, look at those. Really and that one comes, um, it comes in a pack with uh, four different tubes in mixed metal colors. So you will have a nice, so this is the one that the copper one came in, and you have gold, silver, and um, a nice black plate there too. So you will be prepared for everything. <laughs> then some cream here. Christina says you did a great job. Oh, thank you, Christina. <laughs> Crimp. That's something you saw also when I was crimping. Um, you saw how much wire I leave here. Mm -hmm. I don't, for the first crimp, I don't go directly to the bead. Right, yeah. Yeah, this blew my mind when you showed me this. Because <laughs> I was like, you have to crimp next to the beads. But <laughs> Not if you have the other side unfinished, you can just slide them all down like yes. Cynthia is just about to do here. So this is what Look I at do. that. Okay. Sometimes it's those simple things exactly. that you don't think of. Exactly. Um, and someone was asking about those oval beads. So the oval beads are beads 4851. And they're so pretty. Look at that. They are. Oval, kind of milky. Oh, yes. So before I crimp, what I always do is I lift my piece off the table because um, when your beads, when you pieces is like that, you don't realize that there might be a gap in between your beads right. or a gap here because you don't see it. So I just lift everything. So nice. with the you know gravitation, all the beads gonna fall together. Mm -hmm. And then I'm just playing here. I'm bringing my, my cream closer. And I think Trish asks, are we going to do this again? Because she is loving it. <laughs> well, we did we one will. on our Instagram, and we probably will do these again. Because yes. they're really fun and inspiring. They are. They are. Someone's asking, um, they're afraid to use toggle clasps because they're afraid they won't hold well. Okay, so 
toggle clasp, um, I, I will, let me crimp that and we'll talk <laughs> about those. There we go. And we have videos on our website for how to crimp. Yes. Okay. <laughs> Kimberly, I agree with Trish. <laughs> About about making more of these videos. Oh yeah, <laughs> I will. It is really fun for me. I love yeah. Uh, you know, I love beading, and that's fun. So what do you think? Oh, that is so pretty. Oh, that was the sorry. That's the right. Even side. the other way is pretty <laughs> gorgeous, and it matches your shirt yes. perfect. Yes. Love it. Okay, toggle clasp. First, um, here I didn't check because I knew that would be okay. So you want to make sure that when you bring the bar. Your beads are also going through easily because mm -hmm. you want to make sure that the bar sit pretty well here. Now, if your bead was stuck, maybe your bar won't be sitting well on the loop, and you won't know it, especially if you it's you know behind your neck. So uh, that would be one thing. Then the other thing will be this is a really good size of a toggle clasp for this type of bead. Um, a little, if it was a big clasp, then I will be worried that this is moving too much. It's not a big concern for a necklace, but it is for a bracelet. Mm. Because you move your arms a lot. So if your toggle has a really big loop, then this is going to move way too much. Yeah. And, you know, the bar can go easily and you can lose your uh, toggle clasp. But for necklaces, they're For necklaces, so great. it's fine. Mm -hmm. Yes. So for bracelet, just choose a medium size mm -hmm. clasp and that should be fine. Um, I use toggle clasp all the time, yes. all the time. And the reason why I use toggle clasp is because there are so many different designs. Mm -hmm. And uh, this is a really cool design, but you have some with leaves, some with uh, flowers, mm -hmm. and uh, they really finish well uh, your piece. Yes. So um, the only concern will be don't choose a big loop clasp for a bracelet. Mm -hmm. Choose a medium size or a smaller size. And they hold really well. And yes. Kimberly, that clasp is code BCA-TOG04. So yeah, that is a really nice clasp that'll match a lot of different things. Yes. Beautiful. And so. Vicky, I'm pretty sure you're gonna put that on Facebook with yes, all the, we will, the codes. Yes, we will. We'll put a picture of this up with the codes used so you guys can uh, yeah. recreate if you like. Gorgeous. Well, well good job, you. Cynthia, on the fly. <laughs> thank you. Bring another one. Yeah, Bring let's do more. One. <laughs> Ooh, I'm going to have to really think about colors and stuff now. Well, luckily we have these seafood hey, ones. Hey, if, uh, uh, if anybody wants to also uh, tell us about colors. Yes. And uh, send us requests. <laughs> give me some challenge. Yes. Uh, not too hard. But <laughs> give me some challenge. <laughs> But if you have requests about colors or even a, a, a bead or yeah. something, you don't really know how to use it. For just sure, send it yeah. to uh, Facebook and, and Vicky can uh, show mm -hmm. that. And if there's been something choose. you've been eyeing on our website but don't know how to use, we'd love exactly. to challenge Cynthia with it. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. All right. Yeah. Well, um, we'll see you guys again. This was so much fun. Yes. Let us know. I mean, some of you have already said you want to see more, but let us know mm -hmm. if you'd like to see more and what you would like to see. Yes. So um, I will definitely put a link, mm -hmm. links to all the products Cynthia used for yes. this necklace um, later today. Beautiful. Gorgeous. And um, I will be live tomorrow at 9.30 from my home studio. And mm -hmm. I'm going to be uh, showing you jewelry with the links. Yay! How I use the links. How fun. Okay, so. well, look out for those for that video, yes. you guys. So we'll <laughs> see you again soon. Bye, everyone. Thank you for joining us.